kids. It's time for the children's story. Go ahead and grab some. Do you have baskets or no baskets? Let's grab all the green stuff that just had your way up. The lovely Dev Store Camp is going to have our children's story this morning. Um, 
I wanted to read to you the definition of what a shadow is. Okay, so according to Webster's, a shadow is a reflected image. That's one definition. Another definition is it's an imperfect and faint representation. And another definition is an imitation of something. Okay? But it doesn't tell us it's the exact image of it. It's a representation of it, right? Do you know in the Bible that uh, the Lord has given us a shadow of something? Um, have you ever heard of the sanctuary? Is the sanctuary a shadow of something? God wanted to give us a representation of his plan of salvation and how much he loves us. And so he gave us the sanctuary, the earthly sanctuary that the Israelites would have had during the days of Moses, right? Correct. It's a representation of what's going on in heaven. So although we don't have that earthly sanctuary anymore, God gave it to us so we can see a little bit about Jesus. Um, there was furniture in there, and there were ceremonies in the sanctuary, and those all point to what God wants to do for us in the salvation, the plan of salvation for us, right? So I want to read to you two verses. If you have your Bibles, you can turn with um, to it. The first one is Colossians 2.7. Okay, 2.17, I said 7, but it's 2.17. So these things are a shadow of things to come, but the substance is of Christ. And then I want to turn to 1 Corinthians 13.12. Uh, 13, it says, for now we see in a mirror dimly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then I shall know just as I am known. So it's saying that when we look in a mirror, we're just seeing our reflection, right? We're not seeing the real self. We're not seeing our self. Only other people can see us, right? And uh, when we get into heaven, right now we only see a representation of Jesus. But when we get into heaven, we're going to see him just as I'm looking at you. We're going to see him face to face. And isn't that exciting? So let's close with a prayer. Would somebody like to pray for us? Was that a hand raising or was it a? I'm not so sure. Anybody want to? No. Anybody want to volunteer? She does. All right. She has hand up. I would like to pray for Janet because she has cancer. Uh, the story was she was in her house and she was cold, so she went outside. Um, and then her neighbor asked what she was doing, and she said, Well, I was cold, so I went outside. We have clothes on the phone. I have a little paragraph. Can you do that? You are. Are you? Oh, now we have another one. Dear Jesus, thank you for today. Thank you for the children's story about shadows and how um, we can only see a little bit of ourselves, but we can always see more in Jesus. Amen. And please help us to be more like him. Amen. 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 Thank you. Amen. Amen.